we haven't spoke to him for a while. I'm interested to know why. Uh, it's 100 percent Mo. Mo, good evening. Hey, hey where good you been? Evening. Hey, Candy, I've been ringing up, man. Where? I've been ringing up, hey. and uh... I haven't seen your name come up. I yeah, I've been ringing up, but there's nobody been answering. Nah, uh, take a hint. No, that's not true. I'm only joking. No, no, no. We've we've, we've not we've not received calls off you, Mo. Well, trust me, I've, I've, uh, you know this chap who answered my phone today. Billy. He normally every time I ring up, when nobody answers, he always rings me back. Yep. But uh, well, I think uh, some of the other lads are not doing the job right. Well, I don't want to gas yeah. them up, like, but yeah, we just have. That's a par for the course here, Mo, especially on the late night shows, mate. Honestly, the the the, the dross that we have to work with here. And that's just the presenters, that's just us, so there you go. You get served up as well. Go on then, Mo, what do you want to say, matey? What do you make of the weekend? Well, that, that's what I want to talk about. You remember when I rang up a couple of uh, weeks ago and when I said to you it would be 14 points clear? Yeah, are you, are you laughing at yourself now, are you? Yeah, do you remember yeah. when I said that? No. You, did, you have a couple of, did you have a couple of sherbets that night, Mo? I don't drink uh, candy. I don't drink. Yeah, but okay. I was generally, I was, I was serious then. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? No, but come on, okay. Well, let's have a serious so chat now. You have tempered yourself yes. down a little bit. Let's, have, have, a, let's have a serious chat now about it. Okay. So, full, did you say fourteen points at the end of the season? No, I said at Christmas. At Christmas. At Christmas. Christmas. Right. Okay. So now, just to stop yourself making you look a, a bigger idiot than than you've done already, you can retract that statement if you want now. Uh, well, it's just, it, it all you need to do, Mo, the... is just is just say sorry. Candy and uh, and Jerry and sorry to the TalkSport <laughs> listeners. What you got to do? So I got a little yeah. bit carried away. Yeah, a little myself. bit away. That's fine. We do was, that. As football fans. I was a bit heady at the beginning of the season. Yeah. You tell no, me no, to no, say no. sorry. No, no, no. You gotta you gotta ask me why I was thinking like that. No, I haven't. No, no. We'll do that in a minute. Once you've said sorry, have you changed your yeah. mind? What? Have I changed yeah. my mind? No. After watching Saturday's game, we've got our main attacker Firmino's out now for three or four months. And we're not going to sign oh. anybody. Mo. So yeah, but you can't have if, buts and maybes. Mo, Mo, that's what you've got a squad for, matey. Now, look, have you phoned up to apologise? No. If you, what have you phoned up for, then? Reconsider. I phoned, to, I phoned up to just to say I'm not apologising. Like when I said we're going to be 14 points clear, in my in my head and my heart, I believe we could have been. But could have, should have, would have. Picking up the injury yeah. and not signing anybody... I don't think like, we will. You're getting your excuses in early, Mo. I mean, I have to give you no, credit, no, mate. No, Three no. games in, I'm, and you're getting no, the excuses no. in. I, for I didn't so take into consideration yeah. injuries and yeah. suspensions and loss of form. But if any, other teams if playing fan, well. If any fan was going to do it this season, was, it, it had to be the ones that suffered the most last season, which was Liverpool, Mo. Yeah, my sources were telling me that we were going to sign Kylian Mbappe. What sources? Have you got an insider? What, what, what sources have you got? I've got my own sources. Come on, Candy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Talk sport breaking news. Here we got uh, we have 100 Cent Mo, the Liverpool fan, who's uh, got some inside, excuse me, inside gossip on Kylian Mbappe going to Liverpool. Uh, 100 Cent Mo, what have you got for us? That's going to happen in January, Candy. Talk sport breaking news. Yeah, but Mo, you ain't going to need him because you'll be 14 points clear. So why would you sign Mbappe? <laughs> <laughs> so you're even chuckling at yourself, Mo. Mo, Give me it. a break. Give me a break. Mo. You're making me laugh. No, I'm serious. I think I'm you've made serious. yourself laugh. Mo, come on, matey. Come on, come on, come on. So where do you think Liverpool will how be many, at Christmas? How many points will you be behind Chelsea? And you know Man what? City. Chelsea. And Man City. Chelsea and Man United. Chelsea are dirty and a jammy team. We should have beaten you on Saturday, <laughs> Candy. Dirty, you know that. Dirty and jammy. Yeah. You Mo, you couldn't break down ten men. Well, nine well, hours. Mo, you could be, Mo, you can still be there now, mate. And the, you know, you're never, you're never going to break us down, mate. Yeah, come on, that was that was ridiculous. We should have scored at least three or four goals against you lot. <laughs> all you did uh, every what time. If, if that was, if, no, hold on. If that was Mourinho in charge, yeah, on a Saturday, everybody will give him stick that you know he part of the bus. You virtually had nine men behind the ball. Chelsea could have broke away and scored we're, a couple of we're times. We look more likely to I mean, score than you did. Do, come on, Candy, let's talk, let's talk serious here. Right? That's right, let's go bare knuckle. Lukaku, <laughs> Lukaku no. 90, 90 odd million pound. Matip marked him, who was a free transfer. Mate, honestly, look, this, if, I'm not having this conversation with you because really we were the better side. And you couldn't it, break down a team that had one less player than you because you didn't have any creativity. Mate, you where's your extra, creativity coming from? You had an extra man. Where, where was he? He was missing, wasn't he? He wasn't the... Oh, Mo didn't, didn't take, sorry. Mate. When Mo said about 14 points clear, yeah. he didn't take into consideration no, injuries, not, not, he didn't, yeah. loss of form, and 
players going missing when they're playing against 10 men. No, look, how many points? Let's, let, let's, let's, let's do, we've got to go to a break. All right, we've got to go to a break. But I, w- I just want to know, how many points will you be behind Liverpool? Sorry, Chelsea, Manchester United and Man City. How many points will they be behind by Christmas? By Christmas? Yeah, how many points will Liverpool be behind? They're not going to be behind, are they? Well, it, they're not going to... Uh, like, uh, uh, like I said to you... Uh, ten they, points behind? No, no, no. Ten? Like I said to you, there were four... I said to you, said to you, can the other time I said Liverpool will be fourteen points in front at Christmas. Yeah, right. Yeah. So what do you think now? Fourteen now. So I would go for a seven, eight points in front. Seven, so eight you've points halved now. it. So you've just halved it. Yeah. Right. Listen. Yeah, no, you've had your chance. Injured. You've had your chance to apologise, and you've blown it. Absolutely blown it, Matty. Wait, thing is, he's still saying he was wrong, wasn't he? Of course he is. It's only what we two weeks in three games in the season. Of course he's, he is. He's of halved is. the points already. Of course he is. Yeah. He's so, you know what's happening? He's seen Chelsea play. He's thinking, do you know what? They're better than I thought they were. Have you got any, uh, anything to say on the Chelsea game, the Man United game? Uh, Guna or a Spurs fan or whoever you support, 0871722 You are listening to the Sportswear on TalkSport in partnership with Bet365.